there's somebody else that's a king of the edit is Mr. Orchard Beach. If you watch his videos, the way yeah. that he the way that he talks Parks. and he inserts his edits in yeah. saying Barely. You're new to the channel, you haven't hit the subscribe button. About to buy this week. YouTube, what's good? It's your boy Wavy. I know this is my channel, Mr. Orchard Beach. If you're new to the channel, you haven't hit the subscribe button yet. Hit that subscribe button, like, comment. All the above. All right, so before we get into this vid, let me just give a shout out to everybody that's been rocking with me. Shout out to the Wave Mob. Uh, yeah, that's, everybody that's been rocking with me. <laughs> I just wanted an excuse to drink. Or... Man, that monkey oil is gonna mess you up good. Uh, heard it all before. This vid is about the Nike Air Zoom Rookie Galaxies. I was able to secure them joints. Shout out to the plug. Anyway, check out the vlog. Y'all will see where I got them from. But without any ado further, let's just get into it. Or oh hey <laughs> you like I, oh anyway yo oh uh, that wasn't the only thing i picked up i did get this joint right here bam Orlando magic joint boom by mitchell and ness the 95 nba final joint which um they got swept yeah i remember that that was crazy but that's when penny hardaway was you know nice with it and they had Shaq. but you know knicks could have you know went back and did a little better I tell you what's up. I only paid $10 for this joint. Retail was $27.99, but they had it on sale for 19 bucks. I seen it, I was like, bring that here, you know? But then they had like some kind of, oh, you see? But then they had like some kind of thing, I guess if you buy something, then buy something else, you get like $10 off. And the cat that was in line, he didn't want to buy nothing else, but I got something else. You know what I'm saying? Yo, shout out to Amy for that. You know what I mean? So I only paid 10 bucks for this joint, man. And what I will do is, I'm going to do a resurrect. I'm gonna do a rebound. You know what I'm saying on that fit that I I rock with the Orlando Magic shorts. That time in DR that I got flamed for. Let me explain myself about this. Explain. I always ask my cousin. I'd be like, Yo, um, how does look? So <laughs> after everybody like kind of flamed me, and the only per only one person like actually said like, Nah, that, that joint was kind of kind of tight. But they said it in the DM. You know what I'm saying? Ain't one none that smoke in the comment section. But uh, yo, so uh. What happened? Oh yeah, so I told my cousin, I was like, damn, you know what I'm saying? He said it was, you know, I ain't. She was like, oh, you only ask about the socks. That is the dumbest I have ever. So you telling me that you didn't see like that whole abomination of a fit? Huh? I was like, damn. I said, all right, cool, yeah, you're right. But she was like, but it's, it's still okay. <laughs> No, it wasn't. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, I was in DR, so. <laughs> but no, funny thing about it was they wasn't even about to let me in the club with that. Well, they wasn't. They were like, no, nah, you got to change. I had some gear in the trunk, so it was all good. But yeah, uh, I, I'm going to, I'm going to, I, I got, I got this. Whatever. Let's get into this vid. Um, bam. You already know. Boom. Eblins. Shout out to Eblins. These the Nike Zoom Rookie Premium. Size 10. Black, black, action red. Y'all definitely know how to read. I don't know about that. 220 plus tax. Came to 238, 43. It was all good. Uh, I got them a day late, but you know, they were still there waiting on me. Right. I already checked them out because I did some B-roll on these joints, so this ain't the first time I'm looking at them. But anyway, uh, uh, yeah, boy. I am hyped. I am hyped. Is that right? True story about um, Zoom rookies. I've cop about th three of these joints, and it's kind of like, when after I do rock them, it's like eh. But the reason I want these, duh, the hype. I yeah. Now uh, the fact that they are galaxies, I I got the Fisher Price galaxies, the phone posit ones that dropped like last year. I got them joints, but that's not like really galaxy to me. This colorway is galaxy like a motherfucker. I didn't get the original ones. Uh, struck out on them. These are not like a grill. I ain't even gonna sit up here and hold like, yo, this is a grill of mine. No, but I did want the, the original ones that did drop, but I just wasn't able to get them. So when this came out, I was like, yo, no brainer. Definitely gonna cop these. These are fly. Like, word, here, yeah, check it out, man. Word, these joints are fly, brother. I am glad I got these because I, I have been striking out with the, what is it? The, the DB, the foams. That that was a, a, a that was an L. What else? The the sixes that was, I wasn't getting them joints either. But yeah, I did get these and I'm pretty hyped. But anyway, uh, let's just get into this little review right here. You know what I'm saying? And get to that on foot top five best on foot on YouTube. You know what I'm saying? Any questions? We're gonna take it to the soul. This is a glow in the dark soul. Got your two herringbone pods right here in black. 
carbon fiber section right here. Zoom air lettering with the swoosh. We're gonna take it to the medial side. Glow in the dark outsole. Carbon fiber shank right here. Posit Galaxy upper. I always get my bucks wrong, but not when we're talking currency. So this is either like the Dura buck, the new buck, or something, but it's black. Obviously. Black pod at the upper. Take it to the lateral side. The side everybody sees. Same as the medial side. Glow in the dark outsole. Carbon fiber shank. <laughs> black, some type of buck upper. You got two pods on the lateral side. Right here and right here. Man, that Galaxy, it looks good, man. Like, this is a real shiny sneak right here. Wear it up. We're gonna take it to the heel where you got your Remove Before Flight with your Nike Nassau style branding right there. Remove Before Flight heel tab right here. It says Remove Before Flight, but I'm gonna Remove Before Rock. I, I don't really need that. I was gonna put it in the front. Pause. Shout out to Sniper Jones. He actually put in the, uh, put the, <laughs> pause. Uh, he actually put the tag in the front. Uh, I would not rock it on the back anyway because it's gonna drag on the ground. I don't believe that I need to rock it, but if I did, I would probably tuck it under the laces. So it, it wasn't, it's not really moving all over the place. That's how I would probably do it. But like I said, I'm probably gonna take this joint off. I don't need it. Take it to the toe box. Toe box is black with that some type of buck material. White Nike swoosh with black stitching. Three perforated holes. You got your, like I like to say, Pepe Le Pew stripe going all the way up to the Nike badge right here, remove before flight. You can't remove it, bam. I'm gonna probably just rock it with it on, but anyway, underneath that, you got the Penny logo. This is like a mesh sock liner. It's black also. I ain't really gonna play with the whole, uh, they go that early, <laughs> Removing the tag too much because I can see that it'll start like wearing, you know what I'm saying? Kind of getting like, you know what I mean. No, sorry. Black shoe strings. Am I gonna take out the, the insole? Sounds like a Yes 40. The insole is red. You got your number one outlined in black, white, and red. And the other insole says rookie. Same color combo outline. Black mesh in the inside. If I missed anything, my bad. Yeah. Uh, nah, I like these though. I, I know I keep saying that. When I do rock these, it's gonna be it's gonna be new. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna be it's gonna be a new fit. I don't have nothing in my uh nothing that for these yet but it is gonna be new but when i do rock it it's mostly gonna be highlighting the sneak hold up come on i wanted all about the sneak with these i ain't trying to have the, the hat and the you know the tee or the hoodie i don't i don't know i just want it to be no mistaking this is what you see you know or will this bring back like foams no there's all right a lot of people say like foams are dead and shit, and that is kind of opinion and fact if you're talking, if you're trying to have like, let me see, the the denim foams, if you think like that's gonna bring, no, that's not gonna bring them joints back. Cause I guarantee you, if they drop the foam posit one galaxies over again, even if they come with this um this this bluish sole, it, it's gonna be a sellout. Uh. Now would it be overly hyped if they had the amount releasing, like the same amount releasing as they did like the the infrared sixes or um a general release? No. Why? Because there's be no, there's not gonna be any like resale, you know? So it's all about, can it be resale? Cause phones are supposed to be so dead, but when they dropped those, uh, those DBs, why did they sell out just like that? Ah, uh, what? Because they didn't produce enough and the resale. Where'd you come to find out about all these interesting developments? Now, if they just flooded it to the fact that you could just go in the store and cop them joints with the hype be that no. So it's just all about the quantity. I really feel that they need to bring back uh, flight pauses and they need to bring back the original sole. I don't like that real thin sole. Now they got another, they got a NYX colorway releasing. I would probably wait to if I did see him at the outlets. And I know I say that, but I don't really go to the outlets like that. If I if I did see him there, I, I would probably cop, especially if I could use like my discount on top of that. Yeah, but dead, like lugs, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know. I, Cause I see a lot of people, you know, if I, if I rock them like, yo, they dead. Uh, when I throw them on, you know what I'm saying? I get the same results, you know what I'm saying? I mean, I understand if you can't do anything with, you know what I'm saying? If you can't do anything with them, oh, I get it. You know what I'm saying? That, that's dead, but I don't really, you know, rock what you like, you know? If you getting the results that you want, you're good, you know? But yeah, nah, these joints is tough. Let me know if y'all got these. Oh, as a matter of fact, on the badge at the on um, the front pull the at the front pull tab on the badge it says remove before flight as well that's something that I uh, I forgot to mention but anyway man uh, did enough talking you already know I'm about to get into this on foot top five best on foot on YouTube word let me give a shout out to everybody again that's been rocking with me 
I really appreciate that. 2019 has been great for me so far, and I'm just looking forward to the future. Word up. Shout out to um, Effectus Clothing too, you already know. Speaking of sponsors, man, I'm looking for a good shoelace uh, company or whatever, uh, a shoelace sponsor, matter of fact. I almost had one about, I think it was almost like two years ago or a year ago, I forgot. But um, they was BSing a little bit, and it, this would have been the perfect time for them to hit me off with those Galaxy shoelaces. Oh, for my top five on foot? Pff, forget about it, you know what I'm saying? But uh, let's speak that into fruition. Let me know uh, about any good shoelace companies that, can, uh, that I should reach out to. But anyway, yo, shout out to everybody that's been rocking with me. I already said that. Follow me on that Snap, follow me on that IG, follow me on that Twitter. That Twitter B. But that Snaps. Stay tuned for that on feet, like I always like to say. See you when I see you. Ow. We've been in this game over 20 years, and I'm like, whoa, like we really brought a motherfucking top five icon in this uh, bitch. Absolutely. Wow. Yeah. You know what I mean? Some people consider him top five. You know what I'm saying? Some people consider him number, number one. one. Yeah. yeah. I love being flopped, that's just the bottom line, man.